Hey guys, in today's video, we're talking about iOS 11.4 Beta 2. What are some of the new features we can expect with this software? When we can expect Apple to release the second beta? And also a few wishlist items, and I think Apple should fix a few bugs. So let's begin. First off, if you haven't downloaded the product red wallpaper for the iPhone 8, links will be in the description. It's a really cool wallpaper. I'm actually using it on my iPhone 10 right now. So if you want it, links will be in the description and down below. So when we can expect iOS 11.4 beta 2 to be officially released to developers and public beta testers? Well, when we see a major software update release in the beta, Apple usually takes two weeks in between for the first, second, and third, first, second, and third betas. So with the first beta was released on April the 2nd, we can anticipate beta 2 for 11.4 on the 16th okay so 11.4 beta 2 could be released anywhere between the 16th or the 17th of next week so that's when we can expect the beta and what are some of the new features and things we hope to see with this new uh, beta there's a few things i want to talk about in terms of battery now number one battery performance from 11.3 to 11.4 beta 1 is not as good as i thought it would be of course it is a beta software but on the iphone 10 we're losing approximately one hour of on-screen time and on other devices anywhere from 10 to 20 minutes so i think apple should definitely improve within the battery performance we have to see that performance come back with 11.4 as it was on 11.2.6 and 11.3 as well so hopefully that happens now another thing that i wish apple would do is to bring the battery health beta feature into one single panel okay so just bring it condense it just bring it into one single Single section here where you see all the information it's clear you have all your information 24 hours and seven days and you also have any additional suggestions that can improve the battery performance all in one single section not having to tap in here to actually see the capacity and the performance if it is at peak now one thing i also would like for apple to bring is a toggle that specifically identifies and lets people know that their devices are not being throttled because i continue to get the same question from different people and that is okay my battery is at 87 percent it says it's at peak capacity is that still okay? Am I okay or am I still being throttled? The only way you see a throttling turn off switch is if the capacity is not at peak, okay? So Apple should make it a little more clear for consumers because I'm telling you, I get this question a lot. Just have a toggle here grayed out that says, you know, uh, if it's turned off, it means you're not being throttled. As simple as that because when people see less than 90% battery uh, capacity, then you know they think they're being throttled now in terms of problems and bugs and glitches and things like that messages in the cloud actually got worse for me sometimes i would delete a message on a main device and it wouldn't delete on the other it didn't do that on 11.3 so that's kind of going backwards hopefully they can figure that one out i know that feature has been giving apple a lot of problems they've been removing it from official software releases and bringing it back in betas so the good thing about apple is they release something most of the time they release something when it's uh, working pretty well so hopefully they get that one right also to be expected airplay 2 i'm having issues with pairing two airpods or home pods sorry and also the connectivity is also not as good so issues there as well we can definitely see improvements within the software and another things that i've seen on reddit is a lot of users are actually posting these images where they would update their app store applications in the springboard cannot identify where to place them so it would be all over the place so that's also an issue that looks to be persistent through a lot of devices i haven't experienced it myself let me know if you have and that's pretty much it guys ios 11.4 beta 2 could be a release as i mentioned on the 16th or the 17th next week i'm hoping for it let's see if we see some of these improvements i hope you guys enjoy the video and have a great day i'll see you on the next one peace